In this video, we'll try to print all the ASCII, ASCII values. Now, what exactly ASCII is? ASCII stands for, it is American Standard Code for Information Interchange, which means every character on your keyboard will have a unique number. So, basically, ASCII is of 7 bits, which means the, the range of ASCII will be 2 raised to 7. So, it's 2 raised to 7, which comes out to be 128. That means the range of ASCII is from 0 to 127. So you have ASCII values from 0 to 127. Now how to print this ASCII value? You can simply use a variable, we'll say, or we can directly use a for loop. And what we'll do is we'll say int i, the value of i will start with 0. And then we'll say i equal to, i less than equal to 127 and then i plus plus. And here, we can print it with the help of printf, but with the help of system.out.print uh, printf. Now why printf? Because I, I want to print a pattern here or a format. So first I need to print the integer value and we'll provide a colon after that. And then we'll print the character value, we'll say c. Now how, I want to replace this with i comma i. So both the values will come from i variable. Simple. So first person d will be i and again person c will be i. Since we are writing person d, it will fetch the integer value of i which is normal number and when you say person c of the integer, it will fetch its ASCII code. It's that simple. Right? And then we'll provide a big space or we'll say uh, for next we'll say a pipe. So that, so that we can differentiate between different ASCII values. And if I run this code now, run, and waiting for the output. It's waiting, waiting, waiting. I guess there's some shadow problem with my NetBeans. Okay, so you can see we have all these values, but it's not in proper way. Okay, hold on, we'll, we'll go for a new line. So instead of this pipe, we'll say slash in. At least we'll be getting the new line and run. Okay, so you can see we have got we got the list of all the ASCII values. So for ASCII value from 0 to 10, these are your commands and some format which is not which will not work with uh, NetBeans or NetBeans console. The actual output you can see is from 33, which is exclamation, double quotes, hash, even your normal numbers. Uh, like 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, you start with 48 to 57. And then we have the special symbols. Your capital A starts with uh, 65 and it's end at 90, so Z is 90. Then we have again some special symbols. Then we have small a which starts with 97. It goes till 122. And then at last in 97, we have this blank symbol. Clear? So this is how you have to achieve we can print all the ASCII values. So once again, ASCII stands for it is American. So let me type it here. American Standard Code for Information Interchange. Okay, this this is what ASCII stands for. It has seven bits. It's take a range of one twenty eight bit, one twenty eight values. We we'll start with zero to one twenty seven. Clear. So that's it for this video and do subscribe for the further videos.